guys, it's Melissa from Teaspoon Soapery and my daughter Bethany, and we're here to make our next July soap. Yes, this one's a fun one. Um, it is called Let's Flamingo. <laughs> like, do a little mingling and flamingos. Um, very summery and very fun. Um, it's going to be pink and blue with some white kind of mixed in. Um, kind of like a teal blue. Right. Um, and it's going to have a cute little flamingo on top. Um, made some embeds for that. And of course, glitter. Um, Always. <laughs> and we're trying out this layered technique um, where we kind of tilt the mold. Um, so we'll see how that goes. Right. And then um, our fragrant soil is Hawaiian, Hawaiian suntan. Suntan. It smells just like the suntan lotion <laughs> when I was a kid. It so, smells so good. It really does smell great out of the bottle. So we'll see how it works. Um, come along. All right, here we are to make our Let's Flamingo. Let's Flamingo soap. There you go. <laughs> um, so this one's got five different layers, colors. Got a flamingo in that on top. Um, and then top, or is it on the front? Well, top, top, it'll stick in. Oh. Stick out. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Um, and then got some glitter. Okay, here, take that. Okay, and I'm gonna bring this just to emulsion, just past emulsion. Seven one. Okay. So. So, mom will be pouring, I guess. It's fine. Just pour. Just pour too. Well, unless you want to bring the thing over here, and I can pour and measure. Okay. You gotta clear out. Gotta make sure that it's gone. Otherwise, it's not. Okay. It doesn't um, weigh evenly. Okay. We ordered a little um, little thing that helped the the soap offset. And yeah, so the layers are going to be uh, <coughs> angular, and so um, we ordered something, but it hasn't come yet. So we use cardboard, which is fine. I mean, ah, that's better. <coughs> Excuse me, my allergies are really bad. I don't have the COVID. That's what I always say at work. People look at me when I cough. Oh, we look at you funny because you say COVID. Oh, COVID? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm excited. I never really knew that much about um, flamingos, um, except, you know, the birds and the pink. And I, uh, during my downtime last year, my obsessive, obsessive watching of uh, YouTube and various other uh, things. I watched uh, <clears throat> this um, zoo show where they, you know, it's like inside the zoo, the Bronx Zoo, maybe it was. I'm not sure. If, yeah. They probably all knew together. But um, yeah, and then they were, had a, a flamingo that was injured. And, okay. We gotta get going. Okay. So I need both of them. One's going in here, one's here, or one yeah. of these? One goes in there, one goes in there. Okay. So I thought it'd be easier just to, <coughs> if we just mucked up some more containers. Yeah. Know. Okay, so this is going to be the dark blue layer. <coughs> oh. This blue is Ooh, Tropical Teal by Nurture Soap. It's really pretty. 
Yes, yes, that is. Super nice. Oil for that. You give it the taste. Oh, I mean the smell of this. Yeah, don't taste it. This <laughs> fragrance oil is Hawaiian Suntan by Nature Soap. Nature Soap. Nature's Garden. Oh my gosh. Nature's. No, it's soap Nature's. Or Nature's Garden. Nature's Garden. Nature's Garden is where we get the fragrance. Yes. Well, we get fragrances from Nature's Soap too, but. Uh, but. No, I'm sorry. Yes. I think this This one's Hawaiian suntan. It's got um, coconut and guava and pineapple and uh, it's banana. You know, it smells like suntan lotion. It smells really nice. It smells like my youth. <laughs> <laughs> How much of this? A fifth of it. A fifth of it. Eyeball it. Want me to weigh that too? Okay. Don't put it in the soap. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. So and I really can't remember too much about. I mean, they were talking about how it eats and all. I just knew that at the end of that show, I wanted to have a flamingo. Maybe two or three. The baby flamingos are so cute. Yeah, I never. They're little white fluffy things. Yes. They're so cute. So we're going to give this a little whirl. Uh, maybe we should try it with that. It's a little half batter. Oh yeah, that's true. There's like no room for anything over here. I hear the moo crying. Yeah, you can hear the puppy. They're just sure they need, they need their house. Suffering with a belly ache today. Someone gave him a skittle. Someone said to give him a skittle. Uh, yeah, because Andy has eye medicine that he hates getting done, and we have to muzzle him. Yeah, we have to put a muzzle on him, or they will bite me. It's like really hard to draw blood. Um, yeah, so poor baby. Um, okay, maybe we should move these a little bit so they can. Oh, thank you, Patsy. So what we're going to do is we're going to crop this up with a scientific taste. I just uh, took some cardboard <laughs> and I uh, saved it with some, of some masking. Yep. Does it cover the bottom of the other one? What do you mean bottom of the other one? On the side? No. I don't know. The, the other one Um. I need a stretcher. Oh, I can see a little bit by looking at the camera. I'm a looky little. I like to see what's going on. But we got a big Amazon order today with some of our fall. Yeah, fall and bed molds. Which would be nice. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited about picking the fragrances. I mean, that'll be really hard because we got to be careful that it doesn't have too much of something allergic to in it. And just if you think it's good. Oh, well, sorry. a lot of fall things I'm allergic to, like nutmeg and cinnamon and allspice and um, clove and, you know, <laughs> all the quintessential fall fragrances. <laughs> I went to the grocery store this last night and my uh, co-partner there was like, oh look it, here's here's some gluten-free uh, cinnamon buns from Beth from Krusty's. I'm like, really? Think that one through. 
The gluten free is good. She won't get a stomach ache or a migraine. But she'll die. But she'll die. <laughs> So we're just going to let that sit up a little bit. All right, so um, we're going to add the next color, which is a very light blue. Which is our tropical teal. Uh -huh. And um, titanium dioxide mixed together. Very pretty color. I'm excited. to be the kind of Two colors look really nice together. Now we're going to do the white layers. This is some titanium dioxide. Yep, titanium dioxide. TD. I'm going to pour this in here so then we know we have to divide this by sure. six. Because yep. it needs to be stirred up again. Mm -hmm. Okay. A good way to spend our Saturday, huh? Mm -hmm. Soap making is always fun. Yeah. Divided by six. Okay, we're gonna let it settle a little bit more. I should see beyond the bubbles. <laughs> That'd be all that would be left for the last soap would be just bubbles. Okay. We could weigh that out too. Yep, we could. Eventually we might. <laughs> Smells really good. I think we need to just get a little dish of this. Ooh, put it in your lotion. Could we put that in my lotion? Yeah. Oh, hello. And a little teeny bit of pressure. Yes. People will be so jealous. It? Oh, good. There's still some left. Okay. So this one, we're taking out the little bricks. I made this. Sorry, I cursed. I just messed that one up. What'd you do? It went through the layer. Oh. <gasps> Dang, the spatula. Should we quickly get the swishing tool? Probably. For that one at least. I'll try to make the other one better. Blue layer right here. That's 
come up. We're not laying that. No, I poured it too hard. So it broke through. We're going to do this. Okay. okay that's, we need to keep, make sure, remember, that that's the one that I messed up. Okay. Three, four. Okay. Then we're going to make this also. Oh, we don't have any more of those things. Um, I need this. Um, yes, I'm make, just making the both top layers of that one. Okay. We'll still keep doing what we're doing with this layer. Okay. With this one. That's why I'm making... What do you want me to get to screw? The hanger? Is that okay? Back there? Mm -mm -mm. This pink one. This is not. Um, it's not dark enough. It's not like strong enough for my tape. We have no one. You're supposed to. Oh, you didn't show them. You didn't show them what it was. The pink thing is. Show them what the pink is. Where's the pink mom? Where's all the all of the micas? <laughs> Put them away. It's tidy now. <laughs> So, so sorry. <laughs> Nurture soap, wonderlust. And one layer has some titanium. The offset was lighter. And the other has no titanium. No titanium. So what's Beth doing is, let me see that peak. Um, this one has broken through. Yes, I poured too high up, not or close enough. So in comes the rescue tree. Yes. When soap gives you breakthroughs, mistakes, you make them better. Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna pour this one. Do you want um, a batch of to leave in or not? No, it's already. Did you put fragrance? Yes. I can smell it. Mm, me too. Monday I'll be having some lotion that smells like that. Well, bye, Monday. I'm done with this. Can you okay. get that? Mm -hmm. What are you doing? Stop. You're shaking the table. I'm sorry. That's you crazy. Three year old way of asking. Can I do it? No, you cannot do it. Dang it. Okay. So let's take these out. We're going to try it really, really swirl it. I think over swirling is better in this case than under swirling. Okay. We'll go and see what that does. Oh, I saw some blue come up, so we're good. Mm -hmm. Okay, I freaked out a little bit. Why? Because like, I forgot to put this. I'm like, where's the other one? Mm -hmm. Sorry, you go. Okay. Do you need some more? Yeah, I will need to make some more while we wait for this layer to set up a little bit. Okay. And that's a great pink, too. Okay. Done with that. 
opportunity for the smell good stuff. Puppies are being so good. No, no, no Skittles for them. <laughs> no more Skittles. Okay. You can put um, the glitter on oh. or you can put the, those on, whichever. Which goes first? Uh, I think the glitter would be, well, yeah, the glitter first. Okay. So just use half of that glitter. Probably going to have to use your hand. Um, okay. Get all this stuff because it's chunky glitter. I don't know if chunky glitter will stick to the okay. Well, what I will do is first is let everybody know what kind of glitter it is. I know we will. Okay, so this is a master. Yeah, this glitter that we're using on top is a mix of four different glitters from the good glitter. I mixed um, pink opal, uh huh, blue opal, and those are both in. Um, the, the the chunk, but not extra chunk. Yeah, they're in chunky. Right, and then teal, which is in the chunky, the extra extra chunk. chunky. And then we have the rosy chunky. Yeah, rosy and chunky. Yeah, yes, very nice. Yeah. Okay. It's so close, I'm gonna... Gloves off. Okay. Yeah, get some down the center or yeah, not just on the all over. Okay, because it's gonna push out. It's gonna push it wherever you stick it. So do it mostly on the side. Oh yay! So we're gonna remove the last little thing. Get a little spatula. A big mix. Let me show you that. All we'll mix together. You'll have to like when we do the cut. You guys will have to vote. See if uh, you like the original flamingo or the ooh ooh mingo. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. Perfect. We got the glitter on those. And we're going to put the flamingos in this one first. So that um, this one's nice and set, but um, the other one's not set hard enough to um, stick these little guys up. But they look, look super cute. We just made some mountain pour flamingos out of the same Wanderlust um, colorant. That looks really cute. Mm -hmm. Beth was thinking, do I paint them like sometimes? No, just a pink is good. I mean, she does a phenomenal job with all the detail and stuff. These are a little top heavy, so I'm having to push them a little farther in than I want, but you can still see their leggies. And as you use the bar, there will be a little lady surprise. For some reason, I thought they were going to be on the face of it. You look at the design that they made. Yeah. She's on top. That's <laughs> cute. Yeah, these little guys are cute. I like them. Yep, you're putting it backwards? Yep. Because that'll be the pretty side of the bar. Oh, yes. Go spitz this one. Okay, and I'm just gonna put the uh, the flamingos on that one, and show you a picture of what it looks like up close, and come back for the cut. All right, here we are with our um. Let's flamingo. Let's flamingo soap. Um, we got the. One that we did the original idea and we got the one where we did the swirl so we'll cut both of them obviously um and we gotta kind of cut around the cut birds. around the birds 
<laughs> the top is so pretty though. Yes, the top on both of them are really, really nice. You can see all the sparkly sparkles. Some of that good glitter. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's close. I can't wait to see it. I get so excited right before the first cut. <laughs> That did turn out pretty well. Oh, yes, it did. Yeah. Can't really smell anything. Hmm. I know we put fragrance in it. We definitely put fragrance in it, but cause the fragrance smelled so good earlier. But, yeah. Will it come out when it dries a little bit more? I mean, we can try. Well, you can see. I mean,. Well, it has to mark it as lightly scented. Yeah. Very, definitely. very lightly. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's a bummer because it was such a beautiful fragrance. I love that fragrance. That's wine suntan lotion, something like that, right? Yeah, wine suntan lotion. See, it's a little flamingo. It's so cute. It's yep. flamingo, like mingle, like together. Yeah, flamingo. Flamingo, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it does look really cute though. I do like that little pattern. Pattern looks really nice. Okay, we'll come back and show you the cut of this one as well. Oh, I almost just ripped that little guy out of there with my nail. Not, would not be good. Okay, so let's get that lined up. So, and we wanted to try a new technique. No, no. we messed up. Oh. Let's see, was it a good mess up? Oh my god! It's so it's better than mm, look at that. Wow. Let's mess up all the time. That's nice. So what happened is we had a little breakthrough. Yeah, the one of the colors broke through and so I think the pink did to the white or something like that. And so we just poured poured the rest of the colors on and swirled it all up. But yeah, wow, that looks so nice. That's our original idea. No, <laughs> I love it. Oh, so nice. Yeah, let's cut another one. Yeah, that looks super fun, super cool. I like that. Yeah, we couldn't have done that if we tried. <laughs> well, we did it, so. Oh, this is true. <laughs> <laughs> but, oh, it's so sweet. Yeah, that's fun. I like that. That's like you oh, and me. <laughs> <laughs> Same stuff, just a little bit crazier. Yeah, it turned out really okay. nice. I'm happy with that. Yeah, okay, you. well, we'll bring you back when all the bars are cut. All right, here are the finished bars. Um, I think both of them turned out really well. I do too. Here's that one. And the swirl. And the swirl. Which one do you guys like better? Um, I like them both. They're both really cool. I do too. Um, but yeah, the bar is pretty much close to unscented right now. Um, we'll see if that changes, but as it continues to cure and harden, but it's, yeah, it, it just, it doesn't smell like anything right now. So that's a bummer, but you know, some people like unscented soap, I guess. <laughs> You know, some people can only use sun scented soap. Right. But yeah. So great soap. Here are the finished bars. Um, so they both turned out fun. This was the original design, um, with the layers, the pink and the blue and the two tones of it and the white. Um, obviously the flamingo on top, the beautiful good glitter. Oh, I love, I love glitter. the good glitter. Um, that's the original one. And this was our little mess up one. Um, so it broke as you saw, it. it broke through. So we had to do a little bit of a hanger swirl, which I actually think this was a really fun design. Yeah, I like that one a lot. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely, we definitely saved the soap. Um, but unfortunately, it's super lightly scented. Um, it still smells good. It smells good. You can smell this, you know, suntan lotion, kind of banana, pineapple, coconut kind of thing. But it's extremely lightly scented um which i mean some people like lightly scented soap um and we'll make sure to mention that in our listing on our website for these soaps um that it is very lightly scented so you're not kind of surprised when you get it 
these two soaps, along with the rest of our July soaps, will be available July 3rd. Yes, on our website, which is teaspoonsoapery.com. And um, it's also be on our Etsy. Etsy, yes. Yes, we have an Etsy store, which is also Teaspoon Soapery. Um, and then uh, if you'd like a little sneak peek of our upcoming soaps and what we're doing, um, you can follow us on Instagram, which is at Teaspoon, Teaspoon Soapery. Soapery. Um, but thanks for watching. Bye, guys. Bye.